Miyari Kena Ustaka Sakula. Hola y buenas tardes. Hello and good evening. This is Elba, aka Phoenix Taino, playing some Dreamlight Valley. Wait, Merlin had something around his head. Well, hello! Alba, you've returned, and none the worse for wear, I see. Why do you sound so surprised? Well, there may have been a slim chance you wouldn't come back. Stuck in the realms with others, ahem, forever. Um, excuse me? It was worth the risk. Me? Stuck? Not a chance. Um, excuse me? Did I forget to warn you? No matter. It was but a trifling danger. Nothing to fear. <laughs> As I always say, nothing ventured, nothing gained. And now that you return safely, we know that it won't happen. Yeah. Way to gamble with my life. Now, there's something else I wanted to talk to you about. You may have noticed the giant pillars scattered the village. They're strange or creepy. They're beautiful. And we're going to go with strange. That may be, but it's time you understand what they are. We'll start with the one in the meadow. Follow me. Okay. Okay. I see where you went. I'm just going to grab some things on my way to you, if you don't mind. All right, Cookie, I need to sell some things. All right. Definitely want to sell this. And this. Okay. Wait. Hold on. I'm great. That's fantastic. So I was just going to say some cooking. You want to join me? Sure, I'll help with some cooking. Okay, doke. First, we got to gather the ingredients. We need some fresh basil and oregano. They grow all over the plaza and the meadow. Get some. I'll get the pots and pans together. A warm welcome. Nice. Yeah, we're gonna go get that. Let's go see what Merlin's over here doing. This pillar, this pillar is just one of many scattered around the village. For as long as I can remember, the pillars protected the valley and kept it safe from dark magic, but no longer. I'm afraid the pillars are broken, Elba. How'd they break? What's wrong with them? How do I fix them? By making them whole again, find the vital pieces missing from each each pillar once contained an orb of virtue the orbs are filled with powerful magic and each one stood for a virtue around which the old ruler built the valley these virtues are some of the most powerful kinds of magic there are trust friendship power just to name a few power is one of the virtues yes power can be virtuous if it's wielded wisely but i'm afraid it rarely is that's how we've ended up with such a magical mess on our hands so what happened to the orbs when our ruler disappeared, some were lost, some were forgotten. 
and others were stolen for their magic. I have to find the orbs to keep the village safe, to restore the village first, to, to get all the magic for myself. Okay, some of these answers are, like, really problematic. I'm going to keep the village safe. Exactly, as long as you keep what's best for the village in your heart, you'll stay on the right track. Now, this pillar held the Orb of Friendship, one of the most powerful orbs in the village. That orb is now tangled in a night thorn, fiercer than any, than any you've encountered before since the orb got stuck. The wall in the meadow fell prey to a curse and we can no longer use it. You must free the orb thorns by proving that you have the power of friendship. I'll keep bringing more friends to the village. Yes, yes, it's extremely important to get our friends back, but that isn't enough. We mustn't forget about those who are already here trying to rebuild their lives. Small acts of kindness go a long way. You know, like giving someone a gift just because you think they'd like it. Spending time together. What do you modern co kids call it? Hanging out. So talk to the villagers to get to know them. Most importantly, let them get to know you. Once you understand this, the orb of friendship will be yours. Return to its rightful place, and the curse of the well will be lifted. Okay. Let's see. Come along. We have a destiny to fulfill. Hmm. I'm just going to keep giving you food. Okay, let me go to Nikki. Hold on. Level four friendship. Hmm. I need to catch some fish. Hey, Goofy. What's up? You applauding my efforts, Goofy. Okay, we get all kind of fish. Come on. Seaweed, that's it. <laughs> I freaking love Goofy. Is that a catfish? A hook? I like it. Hey. See? Your girl's smart. I knew he liked cats. Like oh, right. What's another thing he really like? You got sushi and basil. Cinderella. Mm -hmm.
No, that's not what I meant to do. The golden doorknob. Interesting. Okay, where's Mickey? Wait, I never did go in this house. Who's in here? Let's find out. Oh, is this Merlin's house? Gotta be in his house. Oh shit, there was something like that in Mickey's house too. Time is running out. Whatever I do, I must protect. Merlin will know how to. Okay. Gray round wireframe glasses. Hmm. Definitely gonna pick that up. Look at that. Another memory. A puzzle piece. It's a puzzle piece. No, it's a memory. I always consult Merlin when making important decisions. After all, a wizard is often tells me to trust my own judgment, which I suppose is very advice indeed. Okay. I mean, it looks like it. Wait, we need to go back down here. I see a red dot. Okay. Got an event. Oh, I won 50 something or other. I don't know how I got that, but I got it, apparently. All right, I need to go inside Mickey's house. And I probably Goofy's house too. I see you, Goof. All right, we're gonna go in here. Oh no. Am I sick? Can you lie? Am I you or she? Fish soup. Okay. Oh, I didn't mean to eat that. Oh, no, no, it gives you energy. It still wouldn't let me in? Huh. What clothes? Hey. Hmm. I think you are you Let me make some money off off the food I have. Hi there, Belle. Oh shoot! I didn't mean to do that. Goodbye. No, come back. We're gonna press the right buttons this time.
What is this? Green rising. Okay, yeah, that's going to always have. Okay, quest. Free Moss Canoe. How do you improve my pickaxe? So I'm supposed to be able to. Hold on, let's talk to him first. Okay. Do you want to give these items? Yes. Well, hello. How marvelous, a golden doorknob with an M engraved in it. Now, this may not look like much, Alba, but it's proof your efforts against the forgetting are bearing fruit. I found this lying around the village. Someone must be locked outside their home. How? Who does it belong to? I thought the local expert on weirdness might know what it is. <laughs> I'm going to use that one. <laughs> Expert on weirdness. That's not a title I've ever heard before, but it does have a sort of ring to it, doesn't it? Now then, this golden doorknob belongs to charming young last name, Mirabel Madrigal. Awesome. The old ruler wanted her to feel at home, so with my help, they enchanted her house to remind her of where she's from. The enchantment gave the building the power to reflect Mirabel's kindness and energy. But even so, we never expected Mini Casita to become quite so magical and so protective of its inhabitant. What do you mean? When the forgetting struck Mirabel, like many of us started to lose her memories. Then one morning, her house wasn't there anymore. I quickly went to investigate, and what I discovered astonished me. To protect Mirabel, her home disappeared into a small universe of its own. Finding this golden door not only mean one thing. Mini Casita is considering coming back. But first, you'll need to prove to it that the valley is safe once again. I'm ready to do whatever it takes. Marvelous. Now, houses believe in deeds, not words, and houses often come to resemble their inhabitants. To prove the valley safe for Mirabel, you'll have to embody the Madrigal's values. What are the Madrigal's What are the God's values? Well, I'm told they always believe in bringing their village together to help the community, and I remember Mirabel checking in on everyone here to ensure their needs were fulfilled. Oh, and she also became quite fond of photographs, if that helped. Hmm. I would take some pictures of villagers. After making sure everyone's needs are fulfilled, I could check what the villagers need and give them some gifts. Fun ideas indeed, Elba. Why, simply engaging some of the villagers in station might be enough. After all, everyone appreciates being thought of. The more acts of kindness he performed, the more magic the Golden Door now will gain. Once it has enough, Mini Casita will return. I'll give this a trial run. I'll talk to you once I'm done. Okay. Oh, yeah. Okay, but, but do I have to press to take the actual picture? <laughs> oh. 
All right. I would not. I need to find out how to go through my pictures. I'll take a picture with Scrooge McDuck. I love that he just walked up and took a picture with me. You stand up. All right. Who's next? Goofy. Where's Goofy at? <laughs> gotcha. All right. Now we're going to go. Where's Mickey at? Mickey Mouse is sleeping. Fine. Uh oh. That's not what I meant to do. Yeah, okay. 
Cracker. Okay, it's still a vegetable soup. We're just going to cook all this shit because it doesn't give us that much energy, but I can make some money off of it. Where's Nicky now? Oh, he's sleeping. I forgot. You need to wake up. How you doing, Merlin? Hello. Let's hang out. Splendid idea. Would be a good opportunity to further our knowledge. Okay. There you are. Yeah, come with me, buddy. Take me to Moana World. Give different villagers their favorite gifts. Have daily discussions with different villagers.
Okay. Give me some more. Well, I guess he didn't like that. Hey, fish. I like it. Howdy, pal. Basil and sushi. That's oregano, not basil. I'm gonna find you some basil, bro. What I got now? Oh, I got some basil. Go right back to Goofy here. There's something to get to you. Yeah. Oh, hip, I like it. Well, up in French, yep. Okay. Great to see Mm-hmm. How's it going? How do I... Make catfish. Oh, not catfish. Uh, sushi. Now, if I give you catfish again, even though it won't be for the first time, will that still count? As giving you something of your favorite? Catfish, though. I need catfish. Where is there more bodies of water? Goofy, why are you always going to stand right in the way? Oh, I fucked up. new kind of fish. That's a bream. 2.6 pounds. Okay. Come on, goose. Break some rocks. <coughs> okay. Well. Oh. 
Another puzzle game. Finding more and more things. Okay. Get a freaking catfish. Come on. I want to get these. Because this is basil. I'll chat with you in just a second, sir. Trying to catch some fish here, specifically for you. I need a catfish to come up, and it doesn't want to. Oh boy, just imagine what we can cook with all these great ingredients. Let's make something everybody will love. A challenge, I love it. Yippee, come on, let's cook. All right. Hmm. I need to get another cash. Why are they hiding from me? Come on. Merlin, too. Now you're running on me. Oh. Yeah, it's unfortunate. Really? Seaweed? 0.5 pounds. Oh, this is a big one. I'll be, I'll be, I'll talk to you there. I'll be right there, Merlin. I'll talk a minute. There we go. I got my thoughts together. More seaweed. I'm going to keep going until there's no more bubbles left in this freaking pond. Mm. 
Oops. Always going to do seaweed here. You know what? Let's try over here. So it's just going to always be seaweed. Oh, hey, Goofy. Oh, don't do that, Inva. Slow your roll. Be patient. Wait a second. Hmm. I keep going until I get a catfish. No. One more time. Your pal, Donald Duck. Hi there, Just doing all this fishing. It's like a never ending supply of fish and seaweed. Okay, now we're going to go over here. Okay. Oh, yeah. Let's see. Catfish, maybe? No. <laughs> Goofy's laughing at me. I'm like, ha ha. You just got some silly bitch. Hmm. I know what that was all about. 
But okay. Look at that. Another puzzle piece. Whatever. Excuse me, Sir Goof. Maybe I need to go to another body of water. Let's try you. Uh oh. Nope. Maybe I'll catch more and or better fish. Twelve seconds later. That's better. Oh. Oh, that's right. I need to eat something. Oh, please, Kurt. Hell yeah. Was it one? No, I think, yeah. By type. Come on, Goofy. Hi, pal. What can I help you? I'm going to sell some tanks. Wow, see how little that's worth? Ugh. Okay. Can you move? That would be great. Oh, wait. I want to be able to, uh, oh yeah, I'm hanging out with Goofy, he's my new buddy, all right, go here. Where's the pleated skirt? There we go. Hey, that's cute though.
Oui. Hmm. Why not? Now for the furniture side of things. Cozy fireplace. We already have a nice fire. Outdoors only, a desktop computer, yeah, that's right. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah. Hmm. Okay. Until next time, later. Okay. Yeah, make yourself comfy. That's perfectly fine with me. You and me are cold goofy. Wait, come back. Where are you going?
Oh shit. How do I zoom out? these photos are ending up, but I'm taking them. Okay. Okay. Yay! I'm feeding the critters. I'm just gonna keep feeding you berries. Okay, I need to go back to where Moana was. Let's look at the map. You are here. Hmm. Oh. What else can I do? What's that? No, I definitely want to get rid of you. This way, obviously, I'm special. Mm. Trying to get sleepy. I don't want to stop playing. The game is so good. 
The game is so good. Okay. It's free Moana's canoe from the clearing. All right. We're going to keep going around. That's where I was supposed to go. going to keep taking a ridiculous amount of pictures because we can. Well, you did it, Elba. Nowhere near as, as nowhere near as amazing as my fight with Tomatoa, but hey, you're only human. Maui, I hope that someday I can be as strong as you, be as cool as you, pop your inflated eagle. Be as strong. Huh, not likely, but dream big, kid. Maybe one day your feats will be almost as legendary as mine. Now go help Moana with her fish thing. The great Maui complete. All right, let me get some banana. I like to eat, eat, eat apples and banana. I like to, oh, oh. Oh, well then, but no, no. Oh, look. Yeah, we're going to pick that. Yes. Mm hmm. Now what? Hmm. There's nothing else holding it back, right? All right. Do we have enough wood? Yes. We have enough of all the things. Thank you. That's exactly what I needed. We'll be ready to go soon. Ew. After the storm complete. Okay, the storm degree is gone and my canoe is ready. See that line where the sky meets the sea? It's always called to me. 